Hey guys. Hi guys. We're live from the office. <laughs> We're just chatting, chatting away in here. Yeah. We're thinking that we should do like daily episodes or weekly episodes live for you guys. Just Hi Joe. Like... <laughs> just watching this our so live. Funny. <laughs> We don't we don't do lives too often guys so yes, bear with us we're new to this yeah we're new but we're just in here talking about um mistakes and how it's okay to make mistakes in life and in your workspace and how it's an everyday thing and everyone makes mistakes and <laughs> sometimes they're funny <laughs> yeah so we were just sitting here talking about like when well before we were in hair school and while we were in hair school and like the mistakes that we made and we were just like dying laughing over like how much we didn't know and how no. many of Your our age. friends <laughs> how many of our friends and families were straight guinea pigs for so long <laughs> Sacr for sacrificial lambs sacrificial. <laughs> and um we were just like laughing hysterically at like what we've done to these poor heads and we were just like well maybe we should share this with everyone because it's a good lesson to learn that mistakes happen and Everyone makes mistakes and yeah, you know, you need to make mistakes in this industry Absolutely. in order to be great and to be good at hair and to learn. Yeah. Practice makes perfect. So, okay. So let's start. I'll tell you my story. So I'm obsessed with, I, I've always been blonde and I'm obsessed with blondes. And, um, I remember it was in, in high school. One of my girlfriends, she's like, highlight my hair you can you can do it so I had like kitchen foil and like a Reynolds comb wrap. <laughs> and a comb and I'm like all right I can highlight your hair so I went to Sally's we got quick blue if you guys know what quick blue is and I didn't know what I was using so I was using like probably like 30 40 volume because I thought the higher the volume <laughs> the, the better it is <laughs> yes. so <clears throat> So I'm foiling her hair, and I wasn't good at foiling, so I, I didn't know how to, like, really, like, make the packets, like, nice and tight. So I'm foiling her hair, and she's like, oh, my God, I think I feel something, like, hot. It's hot, and, like, it's burning, and it's wet, and it's dripping. And then it was, like, dripping down her head, and I'm like, oh, hey, Ashley. And um, so we look, and, like, her highlights, like, bled all over her oh head. Oh, my God. <laughs> So anyway, she's like, um, all right, well, I guess I'm not going to be able to part my hair here. I'm just going to part it like that, but that's okay. <laughs> just fix it. Yeah, just, it's just a mistake. <laughs> so, um, so, so it was all through high school that I was highlighting her hair. And then you think like the first time it bled everywhere, she, uh, she wouldn't have come back to right. me, but she did. Yeah, of course. And so we highlighted again, it bled, of course it bled. So one day she's like, you know, I really like these haircuts, uh, this, these highlights. Do you think you could just put the put the bleach everywhere and just make me blonde oh my God. I, and I was like oh I don't really know I'm like Let me. <laughs> I don't I'm really like, know I don't know let's see what let's happens try it so we just put the bleach everywhere we wrap saran wrap around her head <clears throat> we were hungry so I we went to McDonald's she's like this is really itchy I'm like I don't what am I gonna give her I found a <laughs> screwdriver so she's got saran wrap around her head with a screwdriver, and she's, like, scratching her head. We're like, oh, my god! Can we have our chicken nuggets, please? <laughs> don't look at us. Don't look at us. <laughs> so, I don't know, maybe, like, an hour or so goes by, and we get back to the house. I'm like, all right, we should probably take this off. Hi, Ange. Hey, Ange. <clears throat> we my eyes are so bad. I'm like, who's joining us? <laughs> <laughs> I know, we do kind of look Chinese. Yeah. So, so, we get back to the house, and I take the saran wrap off her head, and oh my god, that was like straight spaghetti. Like, it melted off. Ugh. It melted off. Ugh, like, heart <laughs> like, literally, it was mush. It was like disintegration. Oh god. It was so bad. <laughs> we had to cut her hair. Oh god. We had to cut her hair. Her hair probably took like four years to recover from that oh god yeah but that was a bad one but that was that was long before I was in hair school and I knew what I was doing but even in hair school I didn't know what I was doing me either Not at all. All. I think I was in hair school when I made my mistake but I was at a very bad hair school it's called Marinello it closed down like two years ago so my mistake was um and it was also <laughs> with bleach I think it was probably w2 or whatever that that horrible bleach is w2 i never heard I of that know. it was it was bad so it was like wd-40 basically <laughs> <laughs> no but um 
So my friend, my friend Edona, I don't know if she'll listen to this, but she'll get a kick out of this if she hears it, um, was getting highlights for the longest time. <clears throat> to the point where she had maybe an inch of like dark, dark regrowth from the top of her head. And I was just like, oh, let's just bleach it. Just like you did to your friend. I was like, let's just bleach it. Because, you know, highlights Bleach just, will fix everything. They just take too long. We're just going to slap, <laughs> slap bleach on your scalp. <laughs> 40 volume, you know, same thing. Mm -hmm. We slapped it on her head, and she's like, it's, like, really hot and itchy. And I'm like, <laughs> oh, that's normal. Bleach is like that. I've I've heard that it's like that. And gave her a comb so she could scratch her head away and everything. <laughs> Waited, like, 20 minutes, looked at it. I was like, it looks good. Let's wash it. Let's wash it out. Wash it out. It's big bird yellow, like, straight, like, canary, Hi, canary yellow. Hi, Jean. And she has, like, lesions on her head. Like, little, Hi, little scabs everywhere. Like, because she was scratching at it. And <laughs> chemical the burns. The chem straight chemical burns. Like, it was it was horrible. And then, because I didn't know better, I was like, oh my god, this isn't looking how it's supposed to look. I was like, it's straight yellow. What do we do? What Wait, do we put over it? you didn't process? No. It was, I washed it after 20 minutes. I was like, oh. <laughs> That's so nice. I was like, looks good to me. Straight up canary yellow. I was like, it's lighter than what we started with, so <laughs> let's just wash it. <laughs> didn't tone it because I had no idea how to tone anything, um, and I freaked out because it just didn't look like the rest of her hair. So I was, I think Sally's was closed at that what point. What was the rest of her hair? Like, like bleach blonde, like oh. this, and she was like canary yellow, and I had no idea how to tone hair, so I was like, and you didn't know to leave it on lost. No, I was lost. <laughs> And, you know, Sally's was closed, and she had just gotten a new job, so she couldn't go to work like that. So I was like, let's go to Walgreens and get a box dye. Oh, God. Don't ever do that. The biggest mistake. The biggest mistake. Rookie mistake. Um, we got, like, a 7N, which probably had some crazy name, like, Moroccan chestnut or something. I was like, <laughs> sounds good. We're just going to slap that right over because... Oh, no. It looks good to me in the box. Oh Slapped it right over and it was pure freaking green because everyone knows putting a neutral or an ash right over bleach blonde hair is going to yeah. be muddy Ugh. and gross and not pretty or attractive looking. And she she brings that up every time I do her hair. Like, remember that time that you put that bleach on my scalp and I had like scabs for like a week and then you oh put box God. dye and I was like, yep, I remember. <laughs> So did you ever end up fixing it? Yeah, we fixed it the next day at my hair school. I did, um, I did, I highlighted through it and then I did a darker root and then we toned her all over like a honey, pretty honey blonde, but it was not what she wanted to begin with. So she, she was okay with it, but <laughs> cause she was my friend and she was letting me practice on her, but holy moly. Oh my God. Holy moly. There was one time, <clears throat> um, also in high school that I had a friend which I wasn't responsible for this because I didn't I didn't do box dyes. I only dealt with like bleach. I was like quick blue and 40, 50 volume. That was like my jam. But um, anyway, we went to like CVS or something and she was like, what color should I get? I'm like, I have no idea. Don't ask me. I don't know. She picked some box dye and like I put it on her head and oh my God. It was literally like oh, this no. color. And it like probably a, had like the prettiest milk stud. name. <laughs> I know, I know, right? It probably did. Milk dud. <laughs> a box. Milk dud. Uh, Color milk dud. <laughs> That's going to be our one of our newest um, <laughs> captions on our pictures coming up soon, just so you guys know. So this is what color her hair came out, and I just couldn't help it. I could not help but die in laughter. I was di oh, I was yeah. dying, laughing so hard I was almost pissing myself. Because at that point, I'm like, what do you do? <laughs> what do you do? I mean, you, she bought it. You put it on her head, so, you anyway. know. Mistakes. Those are, like, the two two big mistakes that I, well, the first, one of them. Who's that? She said, I do remember Milk Dead. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. <clears throat> but that wasn't my fault. <laughs> I just hope, I just aided in put, applying it. Yeah. But anyway, do you have any other stories? I probably do, but that was definitely the worst. That that bleach one was the worst. I felt so bad. Heart palpitations thinking about it right now. Mm -hmm. But yeah. So for the yes. girls that are in hair school, you're gonna yeah, you're gonna mess up. You're gonna make mistakes, but you'll learn from them in the end. And it's gonna yeah. make you a better hairstylist. Yeah. Cause don't think that we didn't mess up. <laughs> or no like way. you have to figure out your way. I love when girls are in and they're like. 
have you ever really messed up someone's hair? And I'm like, yeah, <laughs> a couple times it's happened. <laughs> yep. <clears throat> uh, but yeah, my poor friend, Megan, which she actually encouraged I tell the story. Um, she was like, you should tell that story. That story's so funny. She's like, it wasn't funny at the time, and I could have killed you for it, but she's literally, like, oh, my, my best friend. So <clears throat> she was like, you should talk about that. You should tell people that Yeah, it's okay. It is okay. You'll mess up. I mean, just do it on your friends. Yeah. On your close friends. But then, like, I was so obsessed with Quick Blue, and I wanted, like, I used to bleach my own hair that I got, I would get 50 volume. They mm-hmm. make 50 volume at Sally's. Sally's. Don't get that. That's Mm-mm, bad. Never. Bad news bears. Bad news bears. No. Literally, I get like this blonde um, from just... 20 or 30? 20. 20 volume. Yep. Baby light. All right. So, but anyway, guys, um, we'll try to do these lives with you What? at least once a week. But yeah. we're going to aim for... Or whenever we have like a free moment, we'll tune yeah. in to you guys. But... um. You are going to be hearing more of us on our podcast, which you could tune into on iTunes or SoundCloud or YouTube if you prefer to watch us at Pearl by Opal and check us out on Instagram at Pearl by Opal. So we'll see you guys soon. All right, guys. Thanks for listening. Ciao. Bye.